Hello everyone today we will analyze the plot of the 2009 science fiction film of the year the symbol I carried in Brian in pajamas wakes up in a large white room without windows and doors, he notices a suspicious bulge on one of the walls when a man presses on the bulge and hundreds of giggling angels appear on the walls they quickly disappear, leaving behind only a lot of the same bulge buttons, a man sniffs his finger with which he pressed the button, this stage is called study, I understand, calls for help, but no one answers, he presses different buttons, while random objects fall out of the walls from a toothbrush to a large base pressing the same button you give the same item so the man gets a bunch of chopsticks I understandably squeezes the next button and a cart drives right into his legs the next button turns into a button immediately releases smelly gas in his face after a few hours the room is filled with various objects the man hits the ball in one of the buttons and truths fly out sushi, finally you can eat, there is not enough soy sauce for a request to add sauce and no one answers, he presses the neighboring buttons, after which sushi falls out again. I understand, he eats all of them in dry food, he presses the button and finally gets soy sauce, the next press grants him wearing a pair of old 3D glasses, a man sees an angel who points to her button, I understand, jumps, I am somewhat sure that I have solved the secret of the room, however, pressing the button starts a countdown after which a huge ass appears on top in a few hours, I understand, I have read several volumes of manga. He asks the room for volume 6 but 7 appears other buttons give him 8 9 and volumes but 6 is not there the next button opens for a moment the passage to the door the man realizes this late he is worried and forgets which button he pressed after the next press the aborigine runs from one wall to another and then the poor fellow on his head water is pouring finally he finds the right button the passage closes when I realize that another attempt was running towards him and the same result, the man realized that while the button was pressed, the passage was open, he quickly ran to the door, but still his ideas with a fly swatter, a rope and a fan did not work either, I understood, he got on the cart, but this too the uselessly heavy vase also cannot hold the button the prisoner wants to fill the vase with water but the cunning jet always pours only on his head he fills your sushi but now the poor fellow cannot even lift it his hand will not fit into the narrow neck then he takes the chopsticks and slowly releases the vase through for several hours, the man releases the vase in half with difficulty dragging it, only he again forgot the right button, I understand, presses on guessing the truth, the aborigine kicks the vase and it shatters into two halves, an angry man tries to seal the button with rice, he tries to seal the button with tape and also use a metal plate it doesn't work on top of that it gets the bar going down the poor fellow get a strunk on painkillers on his back and falls asleep waking up he wants to brush his teeth comrade presses the button to get water but is mistaken instead of this from the ceiling now the rope is hanging from the Japanese a plan is born to open a passage in the wall and quickly flight to the door on a rope unfortunately the door is locked and the poor fellow again gets hit on the back he kicks the wall in desperation presses a random button and a limiting golden key appears in the middle of the room when the Japanese comes closer the button is pressed and the key disappears in surprise he forgets the button that activated the key the next button releases another dog on the third attempt of the man guesses he takes sushi puts on the button and press it but the base gets an angry dog the next button opens the key I carry D it places it with sushi he wants to swing on the rope to reach the buttons but cannot reach the walls on it falling to the floor I carried sees the plunger with which you can feel reach out and push off the wall on the second attempt he successfully wields the plunger opens the passage grabs the key opens with it too however, he notices that the door holds another combination lock on the top of the poor fellow hurries back and gets hit on the back again he throws the plunger out of anger and activates the button with the natives when the native the prisoner walks around the room, notices three digits on his forehead, the man has to activate the buttons three times to open the combination lock for the third time, he opens the door with considerable effort but the passage closes at that moment and the poor fellow finds himself in a narrow space between the wall and the door, on the floor, remembering how many opportunities the opening gave him the first large room, I realized he feels a breeze from one of the walls and easily shifts it with his hand, he runs along an endless corridor in pitch darkness, it lasts for what seems like an eternity when a man runs into another room, his hair looks longer than before from pie colors the room is empty as the first passage behind the captive almost immediately closes on the walls again angels are visible only adults they disappear leaving behind the same buttons this stage is called practice at the same time the family of the boy Antonio worry about the father of the wrestler who are very saddened by something the wife thinks that this is because of today's fight and the young opponent. 
but the grandfather is sure that experience is more important than youth sister Karen brings a fighter nicknamed the snail man in a pickup truck before the fight he changes clothes and prays at school classmates mock Antonia and the snail man and call the father the guide to the losers sister Karen is taking Antonio and grandfather to the fight site to support their relative in the ring the guys barely have time to take the ear seats in the stands when the team of rude northerners in it fighters are super devil and such loggers than a silver eagle and a snail man appear their team is called kiss me harder first into the ring a silver eagle comes out but a mean sop the dwarfs stand up to him together and beat the fighter the rude man call the snail into the ring but the man does not want to break the rules the silver eagle seizing the moment makes the enemies hit each other and crawls out of the ring the snail enters the ring and the rude man starts beating him the opponent is preparing to hit the fighter with a chair at that moment I understand press the button the snail's head stretches out and knocks out both the opponent in the room nothing happens so the prisoner presses the button over and over again the snail knocks out the silver eagle the referee and Antonio I get it tries to press other buttons after the first press a rock musician at a concert in Los Angeles breathes fire after the second magician in Russia the trick with the disappearance of a woman fails after the third man in China light on his dogs the prisoner looks up at the top there is no ceiling height the angels soar the man decides to climb the walls up every time you press a button on the ground something happens from the appearance of beautiful flowers to death elephant buttons astronauts land on the moon the building is destroyed and the most ordinary things happen the higher the longer the hair of the Japanese and the vegetation on his face he no longer needs to hold onto the walls he soars in the air like angels the man now provokes not an accidental action he is like a god decides what event should happen on our planet towards the end of the journey it is surrounded by many feathers a luminous portal leads a man to the last room on the wall the continents of the earth appear right in front of the wanderer a huge button that he is going to press this stage is called the future how do you like the movie symbol share in the comments thanks for watching and see you soon